What's up guys, I'm back with another video on Hytheria. This is my second video there, this map. I hope you're enjoying this series so far. Flying around the base right now, which as you know if you watched the first video, it's already completely done. And F-Top has changed a little bit. Our faction's at one bill now, and we have the most placed. Glock was above us, but all of their spawners pretty much were from crate keys, but they were carding to buy them, so they pretty much just like got it taken away. And then they just nerfed crates because they were getting, you know, so many spawners from crates, and it was very pay to win. And then they just gave him some crate keys back, and they do have a good amount of value right there, just in their faction leader's balance but it's fine because we have more spawners that are placed so we're increasing value faster because we're making money off of our spawners and we also have a bigger cactus farm plus our base is completely done and theirs isn't so we're doing well and we're just focusing kind of on making money now like building the cactus farm This is our cactus farm as of right now. The rates are still really good, so we're making a lot of money off of this and we're working on it a good amount because we don't have to work on the base anymore. But we finished a good portion of it. It's pretty big to start out with, it's 12 by 12 chunks, so we're not even halfway done, but we're making progress fast. So if we continue to work on it, we'll definitely get a lot done. And that's something I'll be working on. We all at? Over here. We just have to do. Uh, I'm here, Otis. Come here. Come turn around. Turn around. My mom said I can play one hour today, so I'm getting on now. <laughs> Focus, so Gabe. His arm is shredded. Gabe's Gabe? arm is shredded. Yes, What's up, so right, yeah. You guys oh, want to see my titty? <laughs> Brandon! What? Is this what Yes. I don't know where he went. Oh. He bow boosted away. This thing is trying to trap. He's trying to trap. He's trying to trap. I was kicked for hacking. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> are you serious? Bias. <laughs> Mid fight? What? Like I see. Hacked client handy. No, you don't. What? I'm not even cheating. Dude, he did he ban you? Yeah, the ice got banned. He banned you without like screenshot or anything? What? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> He's uploading the video of you hacking.
so I'm above our cactus farm right now which you can see some cactus down there if I go near the world border and look over the edge and these are kind of the defenses we have on it because you haven't seen any of these yet in my videos but we do have a full buffer gen on it now we only gen straight walls because left shooting is disabled so there's not really a point of genning full wraps plus you know it's only a cactus farm but we do have 160 walls trenched down to bedrock with a bunch of sand walls and obsidian walls as well so the defenses are pretty good on this since it is a cactus farm and we did trench a little bit more than just the straight walls we trenched around the corners a little bit so yeah that's what we have for the cactus farm just these straight walls sand walls obsidian walls you know full buffer someone in my fashion just gave me eight mil that's great so you could buy some more spawners so we can keep climbing on f top because we're number two still catching up to number one but we're going pretty fast because we have a good amount of cactus farm done so we're almost at two bill and there's one faction above us but we're the only two factions above a billion so far and tnt enables tomorrow so i'm hyped for that because we're going to start raiding and then i'll be able to post you know raiding videos and there'll be more pvp at people's bases and cannons but we do have the full buffer on our cactus farm already, you know, before TNT is enabled. As well as, of course, our defenses are all done on the base. That was done, like, about 24 hours into the map. Fully trenched on the bedrock, full wraps. But I don't think anyone will really try to raid this cactus farm, especially at first. Because they wouldn't really get anything out of it. And, you know, they'd have to go through a lot of TNT to get through the full buffer. And this is what the inside of the cactus farm looks like. All these chests collecting the cactus in every chunk with the crop hoppers. And the rates are really good from what I can tell. And since we have, you know, a big farm, it's bringing in a lot of our money, the cactus. So when I fly down here, you're going to be able to see all this. The last time I showed you, it was not this big. So obviously we have made a lot of progress on it. And we're getting, you know, pretty close. Making progress at least. We can see the wall on the other side when we're also able to see the cactus so probably like halfway done maybe but you can tell it's just a lot of cactus that our faction has placed so it makes a lot of our money but I'm getting terrible FPS here I'm just laggy because of I guess all the cactus even though it's crop hoppers there's no entities so getting really bad FPS it's just pretty laggy here of course I am recording though. But yeah, that's how much cactus we have done so far. And we're still working on it. So we'll be continuing to make progress on it and I'll keep you updated. So TNT is enabled now. It enabled yesterday so we've been checking walls obviously and attempting raids. We've had one successful raid but I wasn't on for it. And maybe more, I don't know. But it looks like our walls are fine right now. No sand stacks, so we're good, I guess. But I'm going to give you an update on our spawners, because you haven't seen them in a while. I'm here in the Enderman Grinder now, which obviously has expanded a lot. We've got a ton of spawners in here now. And each Enderman spawner is 1 mil, so this is most of our value right here. As you can see on F top, we have 2.2 billion. People above us have 3 billion. And people below us still aren't at 1 billion. So it's pretty laggy in here because of all the spawners and, you know, the enderman dropping. Hopper 4 is huge too. And here's our collection. We're constantly selling it, but it fills up pretty quickly. And the enderpearls sell for pretty good, so we make a lot of money off of the grinder. And we also have the creeper grinder in the other corner of the base, which has changed a lot as well. So this is the TNT storage, which has expanded obviously a lot, and we have a lot of TNT in this storage. So we can be doing plenty of raiding. We have two storage little areas. It's not completely full, but it's still a lot of TNT that we have, obviously. So of course we're going to be raiding because we're making TNT so quickly from this grinder. And then up here you can actually see the grinder, all the spawners up here at the top. So yeah, this is the creeper grinder. 
but we've got a lot of room to expand because as you can tell the base is so big you know 12 by 12 chunks there's a lot of space for grinders so we've got a bunch of pillars set up ready to expand on the grinder to place spawners but yeah that's what the base looks like right now and then of course we still have our cactus farm over here for making money and I'm just flying around the walls we have on it right now but when I teleport in there you'll be able to see all that we have done on it so it's a 12 by 12 chunk cactus farm same size as our main base and it brings in a lot of money because of how much cactus it brings in we have to sell it constantly just because it fills up quickly but we're not even done with this cactus farm, we're still making a lot of money, so there's a lot of work that we can still do on it. So we can keep on expanding the cactus farm. And we've even started to water some of the cactus that's done, I guess, as extra defenses. It makes it harder for anyone to destroy our cactus farm. But this is just a pretty laggy area. All this cactus, as you can imagine, really decreases the FPS. But yeah, that's what our cactus farm is looking like. Well that's all for this video guys, I hope you enjoyed, I'll have more coming soon, so stay tuned because you know now that TNT is enabled we'll have some raids coming up. So yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video.